Hi everybody, welcome to Weekly Thought Fuel again with Sarah and Keith from the Leaders Lyceum. Glad you're with us. Yeah, last week we introduced the idea of a developmental disruption, which is this how we move um, between the, the whole levels in this vertical journey. Today we're going to talk specifically about the transition from level 2 to level 3. So if you haven't seen those videos yet, go back and watch those so you know what we're talking about. So Keith, just at a high thematic level, what are the types of disruptions that help somebody move from level 2 to level 3? Yeah, so the disruption is really realizing that me continuing to win or get my way or have my agenda be the thing that prevails is no longer the best thing and it would actually be better to coordinate it with others. Before we jump into like adults, mm -hmm. think about this is our teenage years folks, mm -hmm. all, all, the majority of our teenage years, it's like we figured out that it was not okay for us to get our way because of what it did to our friend group, right? It created a loss for us if we maintained our current way and because it created a loss for us, we had to sort of let go, well I guess I can't always get my way, I've got to let this go in order for a more connected, more level three lens to begin emerging over that decade or so. Yeah, so when you think about the age appropriateness of it, if, it's, if it is that moving from about age 12 to age 22, which is the level three mm -hmm. age, it's that really seeming to become aware of other people's perceptions of you and caring what people think of you. Yeah, which right? is, a, there's a connectedness there, right? Yeah. There's a level three connectedness there, and at level two, the lens that we understand the world through is I'm my own unit, you're your own unit, we're in competition with one another, mm -hmm. it's who's, whose agenda is going to win. So the developmental disruption that we've been talking about is actually realizing, the, the thing that disrupts the level two lens is realizing that this is no longer what's best. Now, complicated, adulthood. Adults, okay. yeah. In your 20s, still tr struggling with this transition, and listen, Sarah, we talk about this a lot. We're assuming that if you're watching these videos, you're not level two. So this is more probably for you about what can I do to help someone mm -hmm. who is in that transition. In your someone who's in their 20s, it's way easier. Okay, first of all, it's way easier. But you do need to do some things that you do with a middle schooler. You need to be concrete because ambiguity is confusing. As a matter of fact, that's a level three uh, understanding is to be able to absorb ambiguity and, the, and hypothetical possibility in relationships that aren't so tangible. So, so be concrete, define the win in growing and the loss in not growing. It's about the win and lose consequences is what generates growth when we're in our teenage years. It's the same thing that needs to generate growth in adulthood. So I've heard you tell a story before about somebody you were coaching who was in their 30s, I believe, yeah. level two, yeah. and the activities that you had them do were very structured, concrete things to help them gain empathy. Sarah, with rewards and consequences. I mean, this was, a, this was if you don't meet with Keith every other week, you're going to be fired. This person had been with the company for a long time. Yeah. Um, if you do meet with Keith, we think that you could continue to be a contributing member and listen to cut this short because we're trying to keep the video short it was it was even as a coach it was super uncomfortable to kind of live in this i'm going to be so concrete with you even though you're an adult i am going to say here's exactly the behaviors i need you to engage in to begin to see that there is a win in connecting with others so until next week i think we'll leave it at that yeah, next week come back and we'll talk about how to move from three to four, which is really the effectiveness transition. Look forward to seeing you then. Thanks. Bye.